Hello lovelies, today I'm going to be creating this super easy and simple summer inspired makeup look specifically for hooded eyes with this bold orange eye makeup and ready orange lips and don't forget to subscribe below if you haven't already and give this video a thumbs up for more hooded eye looks. So let's just get started. I'm going to start by prepping the skin using MAC Fix Plus and spraying that on my face. Then to prime, I'm going to use this Baby Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. I feel like it gives a really matte base for the foundation. Then I'm going to use the NARS Sheer Glow Foundation in Barcelona and I'm going to be blending it all in with the damp blending sponge. You know the drill, just really trying to blend it all out. Then I'm going to set the eyes with my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in medium because there's nothing worse than a creased eyes, people. Us hooded eye girls really need to work with this. Then I'm going to skip over brows, but if you'd like to see a tutorial on how I do these, then let me know. Oh, and I love it when I brush my brows through and I brush it on my face. For eyes, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette and this shimmery shade and this very fluffy and angle brush to highlight under the brow bone. This is super important in making the eyes look as big as possible and then I'm going to use of course my all-time favorite caramel brown shade as my transition shade this also complements the orange look that I'm going for using the Sigma tapered blending brush this is the perfect blush for blending shadows and I'm going to apply this above where my actual crease is and just above the hood of my eye to give the illusion of an actual crease that I don't really have I am going to be bringing this into the inner corner of my eye and blending it out once you're happy with this, I'm going to blend in using the Clean Color American Icon Wet to Dry Shadow. I think it's in bronze. It's more of an orange color. I'm going to apply and really blend it into the crease as well, just building the color up and making it as bold as possible. Then using this Flat Blush and MAC Fix Plus and the same eyeshadow, I'm going to pack this color on. The pigment looks amazing when you wet it. You can just wet it, but I was being lazy and sprayed it with Fix Plus instead of using water. And then I'm also, of course, going to blend it in once I'm happy with how it's looking. Using a Wet Sigma Short Shader, I am then going to apply the color to my lower lash line as well. well again, you can use water as well. Then using the LA Colors Jumbo Eye Pencil in its great shimmery brown color called Relaxation, I'm going to apply this onto my eyelid, but really only along the lash line and just before the hood of the eye. I don't apply it up into the crease as I find that it only creases with hooded eyes. I might look slightly funny when you have your eyes shut, but trust me, it looks much better than crease liner after a few hours. And this color is really strong and pigmented and really adds to the look. Then I'm going to use this dark gold color called Bronze, and it's shimmer and I'm going to apply it into the inner corner of my eye and slightly on my lower lash line as well then using the brown pencil again to line my lower lash line really applying a lot of color then I'm going to use this color theory brown pencil for my waterline you can skip this step but I find it adds a bit more smoldering effect then I'm going to put it on the outer corner of my upper lash line and blending it out then once you are happy with how your eyes look here, I'm going to use my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NC20 just to highlight in all the usual places, applying it with a brush and then I'm also going to blend it out with a sponge as usual. For my under eye highlight, I'm going to use Astralis AC on Tua Kit and then the banana shade and the soft blend concealer brush, pressing it onto my skin under my eyes and also on my nose and slightly on my forehead just to highlight. And then also, as you can see, using the small contour brush as well. Then I'm going to use MAC Medium Dark and I'm going to use it to frame the face but also to make the highlight less strong. For some added color and bronzer, I'm going to be using same old, same old MAC Give Me Sun. First contouring my cheekbones to really get that contoured look and then I'm going to use this bigger fluffier brush just to really bronze the rest of my face and get an all over glow. And then for some added shimmer and colour I'm going to use my Too Faced Snow Bunny Bronzer. It is amazing to give this perfect highlight, a bit of colour on the cheeks and it's just amazing and I'm just as you can see lightly pressing it onto my skin. And then for highlight I'm using Soft and Gentle. I'm going to apply that on my nose Cupid's bow and then also just above my cheekbones pressing it in using the soft blend concealer brush again. For mascara I am going to use my Revlon Bold Lacquer 
mascara in black and no falsies because it looks more natural I think with this look especially for a summery look and then sorry about the lighting change it was getting really dark and I don't know what happened with the lights anyways for lips I'm using this deep red retractable lip liner in 024 red diva by Rimmel to achieve a bit more of an ombre look today and to make them look a little bit bigger of course and then I'm going to go ahead and apply MAC Morange. This is one of my favorite orangey red lips. It's a really bold, bold, super bold lip. And then after I'm going to then smudge it in using my finger just so that the line isn't so harsh and to really achieve that ombre look. And there you have it. This is the finished look for today. It is very bronze and I love how the different tones of orange complement my eyes and my face along with this super bold lip. Please give this look a thumbs up if you like it and if you would like to see any more hooded eye looks from me. And please subscribe if you haven't already. Just click below if you would like to see more. And thank you so, 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 so much guys for watching. I really appreciate it and I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye.